friends, I wanted to introduce to you a new ending mark that writers use um, to show strong feeling or excited feelings. Um, and I know that you already know it or seen it. It's called an exclamation mark. We can say that this is a punctuation mark or we can say that's, that this is an ending mark because it is always found at the end of a sentence. So again, it's used when authors are trying to show strong feelings or excited feelings or excitement. In the book last week, Not a Box, you saw this so many times. I'm going to, I'm going to show you one page where he is thinking of all the different ways that he was using, using that square as something else. And he says, it's not, 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 not a box. Did you notice how my voice kind of went up? Got a little louder, got a little bit more excited. And, and then on the last page, where it was a rocket ship, he said, it's my not a box. Again, voice went up, very excited. When authors use periods, they're just making a statement. It's just telling something. All right, so listen to the difference between my two sentences. I just want a lot of money. That is $10. So this is a lot of excitement, and this is just t saying something. Okay? All right. So I'm going to be giving you a sentence, telling you a sentence. Um, I hope that you have your two papers ready because I'm going to say a sentence and I want you to hold up which ending mark or punctuation mark you think that um, goes at the end. Okay, remember, this shows a lot of excitement and this is just telling something. All right, I think you're ready. How about this one? We played a game. We won. What do you think it is? Were they just saying it or were they really excited? Think about how you would feel if you won a game. If you showed an exclamation mark, ding, 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 you're correct. Good job. Get yourself a pat on the back. All right, what about this one? Read page 10. Which one? This one? Exclamation mark or a period? Read page 10. That one is just a period. You, they're just saying, read page 10. Again, it might, you, did you hear my voice? It didn't go, read page 10. No, it just says, read page 10. All right, good job. Um, what about, your cat is so cute. Remember, listen to my voice. I could help you out with that. Your cat is so cute. You said an exclamation mark. Again, you're right. You're so good at this. It's showing excitement because they're saying, look how cute it is. All right, what about this one? I'm excited to go to the party. I am excited to go to the party. Ooh, if you heard excitement, I'd be excited to go to a party, wouldn't you? That's the exclamation mark. Great job. All right, what about this one? Today, is Friday. Today is Friday. That would be a period. Now, however, if you're saying, today is Friday, then it would be an exclamation mark. Um, so that one couldn't go either way, but my voice didn't actually go up, so it was just a statement. Today is Friday. Um, what about this one? The door is open. The door is open. Yep, no excitement there, just a period at the end because it's just a statement saying that the door is open. How about the last one? Look out! Look out! <laughs> That's the exclamation mark because you're trying to warn somebody, watch out behind you or duck or whatever. Watch out! Look out! That's the exclamation mark. You guys did an awesome job. 
the next assignment is listed below. Click on the link and uh, fill in, write the sentences first and fill in the ending marks for each sentence. Thanks.